If you haven't heard the news, we're moving, so this is gonna be our last Costco haul for a while. So we really stocked up on some of our favorite things. Hey guys, I've got a Costco haul for you. It was pretty pricey. We got a few things. I think the total was $381, something like that. I am gonna show you or tell you the individual prices as I show you guys what we picked up, but we are moving this summer and our Costco membership actually expires at the end of this month. So we're not going to renew it until we know for sure that we're gonna still shop at Costco after we move. So we went ahead and picked up some of the things that we regularly pick up, our favorites, some extra things and all of that. So I'm gonna show you guys what we got. All right, this is normal for sure, dog food. <laughs> so we got the Kirkland Signature Healthy Weight Dog Formula with chicken and vegetables, and this bag is just under $25. Then we pick up, oh, and this bag lasts a whole month for our two labs, and then same thing with this. These two packages last about a whole month, and it is the Kirkland Signatures and Nature's Domain Turkey and Pea Stew for Dogs. And these are $22.69 for each one, and we got two of them. And then, typically, I get a different brand, the Perrier Mineral Water, um, but this one happened to be on coupon. So this is the San Pellegrino, there's 24 half liter bottles in here, and with the discount, it ended up costing $13.99. Okay, you guys, these towels are so soft, and they're large. They are awesome, and we definitely wanted some new ones. We actually picked up four a month or two ago, um, and so this time we, we knew we wanted to pick up four more, and then we're gonna get rid of all of our old towels. But last time we picked them up, they were $7.99 each, and this time they were on coupons, so that was awesome. And so they were $5.99 each, and we got four. But these are the Charisma bath towels. They're ribbed, which definitely makes a difference because they do have other bath towels there, but we really like this ribbing on it. And it says plush soft pile, and they are 30 by 58 inches. Then I am almost completely out of chicken broth and I use this in a lot of recipes so I went ahead and picked up another pack. There's 12 cans in here by Swanson and this is $6.59. Alright, so these kolaches, we have never picked up these from Costco. Now my kids love kolaches in the morning or an afternoon snack. Um, but we've never tried this brand. This is Texas Kolache Company, sausage and cheese kolaches, and there are 22 in here, and it says microwave for only 30 seconds. So these cost $9.99. Then we come to the Vietnamese pho, and my husband loves this stuff. Um, he's actually waiting for me to finish showing you guys this stuff so he can have himself a bowl because it's lunchtime. There's six of them in here. They're really quick and easy. They just microwave for three minutes and they cost $7.99. All right. I love Duke sausages, but sadly both of these are not for me. I actually picked one up for my friend Kira. Her son Jake loves these, but she cannot find them in the big bags. So since I knew this was gonna be the last time that I go to Costco for a while, I went ahead and picked a bag up for her. So she's just gonna have to let me know if she wants them now or if she wants me to just bring them when I finally get to meet her in person this summer. So I went ahead and picked up two bags of the Duke's Original Recipe Smoked Shorty Sausages. These are so yummy. They've got a lot of protein, not very much sugar, and it's just you know one of the healthier snacks that you can have. So the bags cost, per bag, they are $11.69. All right, I got a big bag of organic broccoli. We're gonna be having a lot of broccoli with dinners the rest of this month, so I figured instead of just putting it into my weekly meal, uh, or grocery haul, I would just buy a big bag and be set. And these are this is nice because it's not just a huge bag. There's four individual one pound packs inside here. So that makes it very convenient for dinner time. And this is by Pure Nature. And um, let's see, it says easy open resealable bag and it cost 
All right, you guys, this is something totally extra. Um, I used to buy my kids Pop-Tarts all the time, like just no lie, all the time. But I feel like this past year, I have gotten a little bit better about watching what they eat and having you know certain snacks on hand. So we have not purchased Pop-Tarts in the longest time. But we are gonna be very, very busy this month. We have a couple changes coming and I just wanted to get them you know, a special treat that way if our mornings are crazy, if we need to leave the house or whatever, because we are putting our house on the market, um, this would be just a fast, easy thing for them to snack on in the car. Messy, yes, but it would be a special treat for them. So I did make sure I got the Annie's. It's a little bit better for them. There's 36 in here. It's organic. There's 18 of the brown sugar cinnamon and 18 strawberry with frosting. And this box cost $12.99. All right, you guys, I'm definitely going to miss getting my shredded cheese at Costco because it's definitely cheaper getting it there versus even like the big bags at your local grocery store. So we'll see. Not quite sure if we're going to stick with Costco or not, but I went ahead and picked up the Kirkland Signatures shredded Mexican blend cheese. Um, this is a one and a half pound bag, and then so is this one so there's there's two bags i'm pretty sure that means per bag i don't think that means total so i'm pretty sure this is one and a half and then the other one is one and a half and this thing only cost around eight dollars um for all of it whereas when you go to the store you can get one bag like this for seven to eight dollars so definitely a bigger bang for your buck Okay, this is definitely something that we've been picking up every time. My daughter loves this. Um, I think I said Yaki Soba last time. I just said it as it, as I read it, and somebody said that the I is silent. I'm not sure if that's correct or not, so I'm not even gonna per try to pronounce that, but it's this vegetable Japanese-style stir-fried noodles with vegetables and a savory sauce. My daughter loves this stuff, my 13-year-old. So we pick this up every single time that we go, and it costs $11.59. All right, so this is something we pick up every single time for my daughter, and this is something that, oh, we don't pick it up every single time, but probably like every other month, we picked this up for my son, these organic Z-bars, and my twins, my five-year-old twins will like these as well. So there's 36 bars in here. They are organic. There's 12 chocolate brownie, 12 chocolate chip, and 12 iced oatmeal cookie. And this box cost $16.99. Then the best brand of pickles you guys will ever have. If you have not tried a Clausen pickle, you definitely need to if you love pickles. Because these are definitely like the best tasting pickle I've ever had. And half of our family enjoys pickles, the other half not so much. Um, but I did go ahead and pick up the big one, Kosher Dill Clausen Deli Style Spears. Um, and it doesn't tell me, let's see, 80 ounces is how big this thing is. So this cost $5.89. All right, so I did get, I went a little overboard here, but I was so excited. So um, we got this, and I'll show you in a minute because we got something else that we have with it, and this is just a better bang for your buck. There, This is an 18 pack of the Stonefire Mini Non Originals. These are great in your toasters for making personal pizzas, all that stuff. So what we do is we will automatically freeze half of this and leave the other half out to eat for different things. Um, but then I saw this. I was looking for this, um, probably like two months ago and I could never find it. I looked at Target and Walmart, I went to Sam's and Costco and I could not find these and I just saw them today. So I don't really have a plan for them. Um, I would like to put them in the kids' lunches and things like that, but I am gonna go ahead and freeze them until I know for sure what I'm gonna do with them. But it's the same brand, Stonefire, They're, it's non. It's the exact same thing. That's why I said I went a little overboard, but I just got so excited when I saw these. But they're dippers. So it says, you know, you can use it in hummus for any kind of cheese dip. You could use this instead of when you're making a homemade Lunchable. Use this instead of crackers with like pepperoni and cheese or turkey and cheese, that kind of thing. So I just got excited and I had to pick it up. It says there's approximately 48 pieces in here. So so this is gonna last us a while, and this cost $5.69. All right, so we got the non because we got this since, you know, this is what first we fell in love with, like one of our first Costco trips ever when we got the membership. 
so good. We love Indian food and we just haven't had it in a while. So I knew I had to pick this up. This is the chicken coconut curry. They also have a tikka masala one. And this is two pouches. There's two pouches in here. Since we are a family of six, we cook both of them at the same time. But it comes with all the sauces and the seasonings and the chicken. All you have to do is cook your rice and then you have a meal. You know, throw some broccoli, some naan, and that's an easy lunch or dinner for you. So good. But this cost $12.99. Then I went ahead and picked up some Premier Protein. I got the chocolate one because the kids like this one the best. This is an 18 pack and it was $25. Then I got some organic ground beef. It comes in a three pack. These are each about um, one, yeah, 1 1.3 pounds it says. So a little bit under one and a half pounds per little pouch here. And it was $19.99 for the entire three pack. Then I got our good old Kerrygold butter. This is gonna last us a while. This has three eight ounce bars in here. We still have a little bit from the last time I went to the store, um, but since I don't know when the next time we're going to Costco is, I went ahead and bought it because it's a definitely a bigger bang for your buck buying it in bulk like this. And this cost $8.99. All right, I have never purchased this before, but we've had Tillamook cheese before and it's so yummy. So I went ahead and got this. Um, for sandwiches or homemade Lunchables or that kind of thing. It has Colby Jack and Monterey Jack. This says 42 deli slices, so I think that's for the whole thing. So there's, you know, 21 and 21 or something like that. But this was $7.99. Then, of course, we got the Driscoll strawberries. I'm actually going to be making some strawberry jam in my Instant Pot. So I need one pound of these for that. And the other pound, because this is a two pound package, the other pound is going to be for, you know, snacking and lunches and breakfast and things like that for our family. And these cost $8.99. All right, so you guys see one is missing. <laughs> um, I actually gave one to my mom, so we haven't eaten it already or anything like that. But this is a three pack of the Kirkland brand organic raw honey. Each one of these is a pound and the honey cost $14.99 for all three of them. We're just missing one because I gave one to my mom. Another thing that I gave half of it to my mom is this Columbus Ital Italian dry salami. This was a two pack, but I ripped off the other pack and I gave it to my mom. Um, does it tell me the size of this? Uh, it probably does, but it's too small for me to look right here. But there's a lot in here and the two pack cost $9.79. Then I got my favorite salad. I love this. Nobody in the house real enjoys it as much as I do. Um, so I definitely do not put the dressing on it all at once. I only put it on. We'll have it for dinner and then I'll probably eat the rest for lunch or something like that. But it's a sweet kale chopped salad. It has green cabbage, broccoli, kale, Brussels sprouts, radicchio, is that how you say that? Dried cranberries, poppy seed dressing, and roasted pumpkin seeds. It is so, so good. And this cost $4.99. Then we always try to get our bananas from Costco um, if they look good. Sometimes the bananas are just too brown for us, but when we find a good pack like this, I should have taken it out of the bag so you can see, um, but it's definitely cheaper to get at Costco. So this is three pounds of organic bananas. It is a name brand, Dole, and they cost $1.99. Like what? I feel like that's an awesome deal for three pounds of organic bananas. So we always try to look at the bananas and pick them up when they look good. Then we did get some chunky guacamole. My daughter Pearl, one of the twins, loves this stuff. She has it for lunch. We have it when we have taco nights or any kind of like Mexican dish. It's really yummy. Um, I never used to like guacamole, but I do like this guacamole. It's super good. This has garlic, onions, and tomatoes in it. It's by Good Foods, um, but there's 12 single packs in here. Each pack is 80 calories, and this cost $10.99. All right, last thing, our garage light is out. <laughs> so we went ahead and picked up these LED lights. It says four feet tubes or four foot tubes in here. And this cost $15.99. Is it a two pack? Yeah, it's a two pack right there. I was trying to see. So there's two lights in here for our garage. All right, so there you have it. That's the last Costco grocery haul for... I mean, at least two months, I don't think. It just depends. We're actually, if you guys watched our live on Saturday night, or Friday night actually, we went live on Friday night this week. You guys know exactly what our game plan is, where we're moving, so if you wanna know more details on that, go check that out. But I'll definitely be doing updates on this channel. But because of where we're moving for a little while, 
We're not gonna renew our Costco membership until we get settled and we really decide if it's worth it and if we have the storage and all of that. But I was a little sad but excited to go shopping in Costco today, really pick out the things that we wanted and our favorites and all of that. So thanks for joining me. Give this video a big thumbs up if you love grocery hauls and I will definitely continue sharing them with you guys. If you are new, I would love for you to subscribe Hit that bell so you're notified when I upload. I try to get a video up at least six days a week. So if you don't want to miss any of them, make sure that bell is clicked because YouTube will not show you my videos if you don't click that bell. This is something new that they've been doing. So I wanted to make sure I let everybody know. But I will see you guys tomorrow with a new one. Bye.